Yeah, James is our MVP for helping close this thing out. Everyone's an MVP for filling it. I know it's been bad, guys. Unfortunately, Topps Chrome has been bad this year, and it was terrible last year. In terms of how it's hitting, there's good players in it, but they just ain't coming out. So I understand why it's not filling. I'm not mad. It's just frustrating to order 15 cases of something, and it sucks. So, unfortunately, this is the last Chrome case I'm posting unless I post a hobby. I'm done with Jumbos, guys. Boxes are selling on eBay. They're going to go. Anyway, guys, on that note, uh, we got uh, Clear Authentic coming out tomorrow night, which is a nice product. Um, it is only 20 hits, but it's all modern, good players, not junk. Um, it's not like Topps Archive Signatures where you get a thousand one ones with some bogus cards. It's actually a good product and sells really well. And they're all clear acetate encased cards. Um, it sells really well. But anyway, let's do this, guys. Jam box breaks. It is uh, 9 or 9 p.m. Eastern time on the 12th, or not 12th, the 7th of August. We're breaking our jumbo case break number three, our last and final jumbo case because the product has been trash. I'm not going to keep on posting. All right, so the Angels comic is adjacent. We got Jamie the Braves and Orioles. We got Ross the Red Sox, White Sox, Greg Jonathan. Am I on the screen? No. Uh, Jonathan with the White Sox. We got Cubs going to Corey. Welcome, buddy. Brian with the Reds and Ian's going to uh, Bill. We got uh, Jamie the Astros. Dad's going to Frank. Chad with the Marlins. Welcome as well, bud. John, welcome with the Brewers. We got Twins going to Jamie. Uh, Gregory with the Mets. Yankees going to Kyle. Gregory with the Athletics. Mm -hmm. Phillies going to Thomas. Bill with the Pirates. Uh, we got uh, Matt with the Giants. Cardinals go to Jamie. Ross with the uh, Rays. Sarah with the Rangers. Nash is going to Matt. And the other Matt has the birthdays rookie spot. Hope you guys read the post. I'm shipping all inserts for Fractor. Well, inserts are refractors, but all the Fractors hits and numbered, obviously. Uh, base spot is going to go to Matt. A discount this huge, guys. Keep this around. Um, I'm not doing a 30 like credit on them, unfortunately, either. So, but I just count the shit out of it. I try and move them faster, but it still didn't work. So it just shows me that the product's been junk. So on that note, let's have a good case and go out with a bang. Make everyone regret not jumping in this. But I hope to God the next couple of years they fix top screw because like I said, this year and last year has been not good. It's one of my favorite products and they've absolutely ruined it. What's up, Corey? Thanks for joining, buddy. Appreciate it. But I'll be honest with you guys if something sucks and this has been hitting really bad. And not just me, it's everyone. We had one out of two good cases. I'm hoping for a third one, but I was selling boxes. One of my customers did buy a box on eBay. He got a, a tiny blue auto out of it. was cool. I sold a bunch on there so God knows what has come out. I haven't had any bad feedback. <laughs> you really can't need bad feedback on a sealed box. I have no control. <laughs> but I've seen people get bad feedback on it like it's their fault. I hate selling boxes on there because I don't know what's getting pulled. It drives me nuts. Yeah, they got to stop bumping the retail, Kyle. <clears throat> Here's my whole thing with the retail. You're paying $20 a damn box, okay? Why Why are you making that hot when people are spending $200? Well, retailing this is $240 on a jumbo box and giving them one color auto, maybe, and shitty relief pictures. I mean, base autos. It's not right, man. And this is why Tops, Tops is going to lose their customers eventually. Problem with tops, I mean, everyone's still gonna buy them. And he's a breaker. I, I boycotted a lot of their products uh, two years ago because I was ticked off at them. And it doesn't bother me to just break Panini. I'll contact Panini and tell them I'll be an exclusive if they give me better deals because I'm tired of the way they're doing stuff, to be honest with you. I really am. All right, Thomas Nito for the Mets. Another bum. Quinn Gregory. But I'm uh, really tired of the way they're uh, allocating out these products and charging out the ass for them because of one big player. It's not good. If you're going to do that, you better make the product sit good. That's all I'm saying. And Sarah, Tani's not a short print in this. He's got a ton of freaking autos. He's got every color. 
Um, they just made so many cases. You know, they say they're not going to make that many cases anymore. That they'll be better, and they've gotten worse since they've had a player like Judge in here and now Atani. Really have Aston Russell in the black and white. They've been getting worse. Andrew Stevenson for the Nets going to Matt. I think I put Mike. Matt, I think I put Mike for the Nets. I meant to put your name. Well, PZ, they, they want Walmart and Target to be their their target, and then start making products for children because. Children shop at Walmart and Target for boxes, not adults. I mean, obviously, adults do too, the ones that can't afford the hobby boxes, and I can understand that, but they're made for children. Um, and then the problem is, is people are opening them up and returning them, and then you're opening them up and you're getting like 1989 Don Russ packs in them. And then you try and bring it back, and Walmart's like, nope, you did that. So they got to stop. They got to stop doing stuff this way. All right, Clint Frazier, number two, uh, 299. They need to focus more on the people that are actually spending the money on their hobby boxes, so they're going to start losing a lot of a lot of business. Zach Granit for the Twins going to Jamie. What's up, Steve? The problem is now the breakers, are, there's so many of them, they know the products are going to sell out, so they just don't care. They sell out months in advance, and we have no idea if it's going to hit good or not. <clears throat> and then we lose out because we're stuck with all their product, and it's not selling. And then you got people doing fire sales on eBay on cards that shouldn't be selling for as low as they are. All right, we got a backwards card. Dylan Peters is backwards. That's kind of weird. It's not a uh, parallel. All right. Well, there's Dylan Peters in the refractor number 499, Miami, going to Chad. So, new guys, please make sure you PM me your uh, mailing address and also your email so you get tracked when I ship. And I save it, so I always have it on file for you. Yeah, Kyle's the same thing. I, I agree with you. It's, they just, they just they're concerned about the money. But like I said, if you're going to focus on products like that, then they should be making more kids' products. They keep saying they want to focus on getting more people in the hobby. No more Mazar, number two, uh, 150. I mean, if you watched our Q&A, especially the one for the National... All Top spoke about was how we want to get children in the hobby, how it's how it's growing. Well, it's going to not grow if you're doing this to people because spending two hundred forty dollars on one of these boxes and getting four base autos is not uh, that great. JD Davis, Houston, going to Jamie. It's not the way you do stuff. Yeah, well, the variations are refractors, Kyle. So if I pull any variations, I'll see them because they're refractors. They're all refractors. We actually got six autos in the for five. No, we got five. I thought we had six. All the variations are refractors, so there's no non-refractor variations. Box two. Who else hit? Washington, New York, Minnesota, Marlins, out in Houston. I don't even got a mark on that to a like crap. Yeah, all inserts are refractors too, Sarah. The only thing that's not shipping is the base cards. The regular Chrome cards are not shipping this because I, I made this a lot cheaper than everyone else around. And I'm telling you right now, most breakers aren't even shipping any of the refractors or base. Only numbered and in colored. So I always ship everything, but if I got a discount this much, I'm not going to take three hours to, to sort it because that does take that long. My face is a variation, Kyle. You know why? Because it's that good looking. <laughs> it's different from most. <laughs> Dickhead. That's a compliment. I don't want to look like the rest of you. Sorry if any of you are annoyed with that post I put up. It had nothing to do with politics. I'm really agitating when that stupid Canadian came on there and started bashing the president. I don't care where your views are, guys. The post is about getting the baseball signed by the president. I don't care if it was Obama, Clinton, whoever. It's really cool if you watch the video how he got him to sign the ball. And that's why I posted it. Nothing to do about the president. It's a cool, iconic piece of history that the president told him to throw him the ball in the pen on stage, which is not common for a president to do because Secret Service would be all over that usually, and he wasn't. It was It's pretty pretty neat. All right, going to Jamie, Lucas Sims, Braves. 
Sarah, you never lose your lunch. Sarah, Sarah's got an undying love for me. She just won't admit it. She keeps trying to get me to Texas. I'm like, no, Sarah, you're married. You can't do that. <laughs> she keeps just trying to tell me to sell me insurance, but, but honey, you you can't sell insurance to people in Maryland, so I don't believe you. And then Jamie wanted to marry me when I pulled her the Atani orange I sold for fourteen thousand. Jamie Jamie basically proposed to me on the phone. <laughs> Tim Beckham number to ninety nine on the green. Jamie really like proposed to me on the phone when I when I hit it at Atani that sold for fourteen thousand dollars. <laughs> but she still cheats on me with Pete, which is messed up. All right, AJ Minter going to Jamie. You got killed in that immaculate break, Jamie. You got killed in that last night. I felt bad for you. I hope. God, I don't know how he did it at that price. He he's desperate to get rid of his cases before that baby's born. He he evened out on that. He's an idiot. He pissed me off when he posted that. Jacob Barnes for the brew crew. I can't I can't even out. There's there's no point going to John. He's just going to be gone for probably two weeks once she has the kid. He thinks he's going to be gone for a week. It's going to be longer than that. Yeah, but you guys screwed on that. You're going to do better in mine. Watch. What are you saying, Pusick? Oh, I know you weren't, Kyle. I watched it. That's how we became friends on Facebook. You, I saw someone share your post, and I wanted to watch it, so I fronted you. That's how we became friends. All right, Mr. Cisco. He's usually a uh, usually uh, a redemption. So we got a live one going to Jamie. Rick might want to buy this Jamie since it's live. I don't know if he has it. I'm sure he has it, but I haven't seen a live one yet. Since his son, that's his son's live card. No, Sarah, but you don't buy anyone but Texas and Miami. How could they ever pull you a fourteen thousand dollar card? Nah, Matt, no, no supers yet, buddy. How much does it pull you a fourteen thousand dollar card when you buy a team that has shitty checklists? Iglesias on the black and white. It's not gonna happen. A Marino one one auto won't even pull that much. All right, we have a uh, Tehran Guerrero in the purple for Miami, number two ninety nine. Two ninety nine? No, two fifty. Sorry, somewhere two ninety nine for some reason. Uh, Marlins going to Chad. It seems like the cheap teams are what are hitting in this, which isn't a good thing. Well, Sarah, I can't figure it out. You give me a better checklist with your teams, and I'll try and pull you something better, but. You don't give me much to go off of. All right, box three. And Jamie didn't even try to have the Angels in that break. She just got them on the random team break we did. She was lucky. And then she won them again, and we thought we were going to get another one. Sarah, but then you buy teams like the Rams. Baseball, you buy teams like the Astros. I can't, I can't pull you a big card if these guys aren't selling for that. Now, granted, the Astros when Bregman was hot, you wouldn't bring that much, but there was a chance to pull a big card, and I didn't pull any for you. But now, there's nobody on the team that'll pull anything over hundred dollars. Yeah, that was your lucky day for sure. And I'm glad that we pulled it when we did, Jamie, and we sold it when we did because. Unfortunately for that buyer, he's never going to get his money back on that. Unless Atani out of nowhere starts hitting home runs again, which is possible. I have an Atani right now that's a 3 of 5 patch auto that I'm sitting on, you know. I got it priced high, so I get a good offer. I ain't selling it. Because I have a feeling he's going to have a good end of the year and start hitting a lot of home runs, and then I can sell it then. I know you're poor, sir, but the only way to get rich is to, is to gamble. <laughs> That's why you do breaks. Ryder Jones for San Fran going to Matt. Tough shit for who, Matt? I personally don't think a ton he's anything special. He, he can hit, yeah, but his pitching really is not that good. He's not lights out. I, I don't see the hype on him. Maybe because he's from Japan? Walker Buehler to uh oh that's right just the regular purples are two ninety nine, two ninety nine for Dodgers. But I don't know. 
The hype's going to be gone next year. No one will even care about him. He'll be like Tanaka all over again. No one's going to give a crap about him. And next year we'll have we'll have bigger guys. I think next year's going to be good uh pro good for products if they put a lot of the new draft guys in. If they actually like move up quick. Dude, he's not a good pit man. He's not a good pitcher if you look at his numbers though. All right, we got Andrew Miller, gold, number to 50. He's not as good as everyone thinks. His, dude, his pitching numbers in Japan, go look at him. His ERA was almost a four. How is that good? Felix Hey, Minnesota. Uh, Minnesota's Jamie. Can he swing a bat? Yes, I'm not denying that. But can he pitch? No. He's not an elite pitcher, dude. He's average. He's an average pitcher in baseball. Does he have some nasty stuff? Yes, but he still his numbers are average, man. He's not a, he's not a superstar. He should be selling for what he is. Very nice for the Dodgers. Going to uh, Thomas, right? No, going to Frank Alex Verdugo, number to two fifty. Nice hit, buddy. Exactly, it's his first year. Guess what happens usually, Matt? After someone learns a pitcher after their first year, they ain't gonna do nothing afterwards. Most don't last, dude. Especially the Japanese pitchers. Most do not last. Look at Hideo Nomo. Look at uh, Chan Ho Park. Come on, dude. To even Tanaka. I mean, Tanaka's decent, but he's not an elite pitcher. He's a good starter. He's not a number one, though. They're making out a time to be like the best thing since Babe Ruth. It's not. Mookie Betts. All right, Tanner Scott for the O's. Going to Jamie. He's not even close to a Babe Ruth. It, it, it's so funny they compare him to him. Next Babe Ruth. Get out of here with that garbage. Well, so far he's not better than an average pitcher. So I'm not going to say that he will be because based off his numbers right now, he's not that good. You can watch him all you want. His mechanics are solid, but he's getting hit. People are hitting the ball off of him. Yeah, and then he got well. Then he got Darvish. He didn't last long either. Whether he blew his arm out or not, he still blew his arm out. Ronald Herrera for Texas. Going to Sarah. Matt, you're talking about his numbers this month. The month just started. We're on the seventh day of August. Tony, next year, dude, his cards will be a hundred bucks all day. If that, just watch. I know the hobby, dude. No one's gonna give a shit about him next year. I mean, you guys got, got guys like Kershaw and uh, what's his name from the Indians? He's on uh, Kluber. You got Max Scherzer. You got Chris Sale. You got, they don't sell for crap, dude. He's no Jeff Conite. <laughs> what, what do them guys sell for, dude? Nothing. Craig Kimbrell sells better than all of them. I mean, that just shows you where the hobby's at in collecting. Craig Kimbrell sells higher than Chris Sale and Max Scherzer. Come on. Hey, man, don't mess with Jeff Conine, dude. Jeff Conine was the man. <laughs> and then you got John Olerud, Mr. I wear a hat at first base, a helmet. Oh, we got a white redemption. I haven't seen a white redemption yet. You know what's funny if that we pull that? Who's got the Mets? Gregory's got the Mets. Okay, so the Mets got dropped by Huddleston. Huddleston ran into a money issue. Huddleston never drops teams because he knows in my group, you drop a, tween, a team, I'm going to hit the card that you want it. And he asked me for the Grom. No, it's Syndergaard Auto. And he says a White Redemption. Watch that be the Syndergaard Auto, White Redemption. And I will tag him, and I will laugh at him. Oh, I'll keep pulling the Tonys. Don't, don't get me wrong on that. I'm just saying. It's, I just, I don't see where it, where people are paying that much for them. I, I don't, I don't understand it. And if you want to pay that much for them, go ahead. But I just think you're dumb. I think you should wait till next year and buy it when it's more affordable. Yeah, hobby has been coming, become about chasing the maybes. I agree with you on that. The ninety nine, Clint Fraser. I, I hundred percent agree with you on that. Matt, he has horrible numbers for what he's selling for. He's selling higher than Mike Trout, for God's sakes. 
He has horrible numbers as a pitcher for what the guy is selling for. Yes. I will not take that back. There's no reason his autos should be selling as high as they are. Not a reason at all. Nice. Verdugo Refractor out of 499. Dodgers killing it. Well, there you go, Frank. You're, uh, your spot's more than well paid for. His numbers don't prove me wrong for what his sales are at, Matt. There's no reason his base auto should be selling for three, four hundred dollars net. Still, they were selling for a thousand. Ah, look, there's Huddleston. Here we go, Huddleston. You're on. You know how it is. You drop the team. I hit the card. You want it. it happens a lot. Brian Anderson from Miami. Going to Chad. We got that. We got that. Cinder Who'd you want? You want a Syndergaard, right? Isn't that what he told me? He said, you know, I'm going to pull it. There's a white redemption. You told me that. Chris Davis out of 150 on the blue wave. Cy Young wouldn't be loving up to it. Come on, man. He's not very good. He's an average pitcher. Now, they get in the playoffs and he starts killing it, then I'll give him some props. Harrison Bader. Until then, dude, he ain't, no, he ain't nothing. Uh, going to Jamie, Cardinals. I'm not saying he's trash, dude. I'm just saying compared to what he's selling for, he's that's where he's trash. He should not be selling higher than Mike Trout. I'm sorry. Mike Trout's the best player in baseball in a very, very long time. And you shouldn't be out doing him in sales. You, it just shouldn't be happening. There, what we go. Oh, your your boyfriend, Jamie Bader. That's your new boyfriend. All right, let's see who the redemption is. Here we go. Do to receive a rookie? Nope, it's not going to be. It's not going to be. Uh, what you call it? But it's going to be a medallion autograph. Rookie debut medallion autograph card of Raphael Devers. Very nice for Boston going to Ross. Very nice. Sucks. I want to pull one of them live. I haven't pulled a medallion auto yet. I know the deal on rookie autos, Matt. They sell way too high in the beginning, but what I'm saying is no one should be selling higher than Mike Trout. Prospect autos do because it's their first Bowman. A town didn't even have a first Bowman. All right, Mella Reds. He came from Japan. He had a rookie Bowman. He shouldn't be selling that high. Uh, going to Brian. Oh, I still can pull it, Jason. We still have four boxes left, buddy. That's all I'm saying, Matt. I'm sorry that you're so butthurt over Atani. You're not even a fan of that team. Who is your team? Washington. Is that your team? I don't even know your team. You're all over the place when you buy teams. You're, you're a Braves fan, right? Isn't that your favorite? Ian Happ. I'm going to buy him all the time. You and Eric did it. Where has Eric been? Eric needs to come back. Eric was our closer. All right, we got Troy uh, Schreibner. Angels. That's going to go to Jason. Number two, uh, 150 on the blue wave. Eric said he was coming back last week. I haven't seen him. <laughs> trying, Pete. I'm trying, buddy. So far, it actually hasn't been a bad case. Got three solid hits. Two Verdugos and Endeavors. Out of four boxes. I can't complain about that. All right, next box. I don't think Shriver sells any good. Oh, uh, you have been an Eagles fan? I didn't know who you were a fan of, dude. I said, one day you like Washington, one day you like Lana, and one day you like them. <laughs> so like, we got Brian. Brian Wilhelm. He only, only buy the Reds. He's a fan of the Reds. Once in a while, he'll splurge in another, but he's a Reds guy. So I can always count on him for buy the Reds. Jamie, she's a big Cardinals person, but she will splurge like she did tonight. Frank is mainly a Dodgers guy. 
He's bought other teams, but he's mainly Dodgers. Uh, Thomas is whoever's hot, so that's why he took the Phillies. <laughs> Sarah's only Rangers. Sometimes Houston, I think not. Okay, another medallion card. We got two of them in this case. So it's... Jonathan's usually just Nats. Same with Chad. Chad's Yankees and Nats. Yeah, Angels are expensive, man. You got him and Trout now. I mean, it's, it's tough. My McMahon, number 299. Wait till Joe Adele comes out. Matt, you're not going to be able to, no one's going to be able to afford to, he's going to be selling higher than Atani. Joe Adele. I, if he's, if he's in Berman Crown, we're screwed. That, they're going to be $800. <laughs> Raise Maranto. It'll be good for everyone else. Same friend. Going to Matt. I heard, I heard Adele is going to be in, in Berman Crown. I'm not positive, but I have heard. To the grapevine that he's going to be in it. And if he is, because he's already had one Bowman auto, so he can def technically be in it. They can make him a rookie in it. They bring him up. And uh, it's good. the Angels are going to be through the roof. Oh, what's up, Ross? Hey, Ross, you owe me payment, punk. <laughs> I know you're good for it. Vieira, White Sox, number 49. Yeah, you usually pick the Reds, too. You do. One Stencil comes up, but he's... Isn't he hurt again? Didn't he just get injured for the year? Nice. I, I, we pulled a bunch of Adele's when he wasn't selling good. All right, White Sox. It's going to go to uh, Jonathan. Adele's first Berman prize. We pulled a bunch. I think it was Berman, uh, Berman Draft, right? He was selling for like 75 bucks. Now he's selling me God. His base holders are selling for a ton. Italian, number 99 for the Pirates. Green wave. Oh, okay, Sarah. Well, you guys, in the first two Topps Chrome cases, I'm just letting you know, you got a lot of base. There's a lot more than I thought. It took actually a while to sort. I'm usually pretty quick, but... And now I didn't go out today because I didn't get the second one done. Well, it's my fault. I didn't wake up early as I wanted to today, and I had to leave for the whole day, so... No variations yet, which is kind of weird. Usually you have, like, one or two by now. All right, we didn't get an autograph from Dalian. All right, Jackson Stevens for the Reds going to Brian, number to 150. Yeah, Soto autos are nuts. Uh, Chad just asked me tonight, Stewart, if he should sell Soto, Robles, or uh, Robles, or uh, what should we call it? Um, some other person. I told him to do Soto now, man, because he's at his peak. He ain't going to go any higher than that. Uh, Jose Altuve, number 99 for the Astros. I don't see him going higher. He's not going to hit ju Aaron Judge status when um, by the end of the year. He'll because he was hot. He was actually pretty hot when he first came out, and then it dwindled down. And I sold all mine really cheap. And I was like, "Yeah, it's all hype. He's already going down." And then, um, yeah, I kind of wish I held him now. I mean, I say that about a lot of guys. I'll say that about a bunch of these cards I have that are selling for five bucks. That I have up for five bucks selling. John Lester, Blue Wave to one fifty. Uh, he's not going to be in Chrome, Matt. The top's already confirmed it. Juan Soto won't be in until um, um, Top's Update Two, which I think I ordered cases of that, which I'm glad now because I hate that product. Top's update I usually order because it usually has the newer autos in it. Kyle Farmer, Dodgers. Going to Frank. All right, Dodgers, you're done. But Soto is not going to be in Chrome. They were asked at the National, and they said he will not be in Chrome, which kind of sucks. But I think Adele is, and that will make the product a lot go crazy. It's it's super expensive this year, guys. I'm paying a lot more than I usually do for Boom and Chrome, and I'm not happy about that because I think that product is junk, too. You get one good color auto case. So I'm not a fan of Bowman Chrome. I'm not actually a fan of any Bowman, period. Sandy Alcantara Marlins. I think it rips off the collectors. Going to Chad. I mean, Grant, the big hits do sell big, but you ain't getting a lot per case. Maybe one or two. Sometimes none. Tops Chrome, at least it's usually affordable. Not this year, but it's usually semi-affordable. And you know you're gonna get some cards that'll sell good. This year it's just been it's been terrible. 
Box six. You know, I used to buy cases of this for years to open myself, way before I was a breaker. Because I couldn't afford the boom, and I, I always bought the tops instead, the tops of chrome. And I always thought it hit better, but now, past two years, oh. Well, we got another redemption. The last year, the only, there was like two players to hit in Topps Chrome. It was uh, Aaron Judge. And what else was it? Bellinger. And I think we got Correa's autos from the year before, right? There was that in Bowman. We had Correa's from the year before. Maybe that was two years ago, three years ago. They didn't produce all those autos. They held on to them. But they got to stop doing that shit, too. They said they have surprises coming up for Ben and Kern. So we'll see who's popping up in that that should have been in previous years. But it's super expensive this year. All right, guys. Buck six. So we have a good redemption here. We're not Soroka or something. Soroka's actually not selling bad. All right, Richard Arena, Blue Jays. Combo stock, one of Jason. Andy, you should have taken the Dodgers in this, dude. I hit a Verdugo Refractor, a Verdugo Purple, and a Kyle Farmer. The comments working still? You guys haven't sent it. There we go. Uh, ben Attendee, I don't know if he was in Top Scrum last year. I thought he was just in Booming. Maybe he was. His, his prices have dropped tremendously, though. He's, he's actually playing. Devers, too. They're both playing really well. I don't know what happened to them. All right. Schreibner again. Base auto this time. It's going to Jason. That's what I'm saying. It's all about the hype of the guys. Like, um, Albies and, uh, and uh, Acuna won't be selling that good next year. Watch. They'll be they'll be selling for nothing. We'll be pulling their autos left and right next year. Scott Kingerly, number 99. Was he? I couldn't remember. But it wasn't hit, and that's the thing, Sarah. Like, we were lucky to get a Judge, or we were lucky to get a Bellinger, or we were lucky to get a Benintendi then. It wasn't hitting last year at all. It was it was, it was, was a worse checklist last year than it is this year. All right, we got A.J. Minter on the gold. Too bad that's not Soroka. Braves going to Jamie. Number to 50. Was he in Top's Crack? I can't remember. I figured he was. I just I don't remember pulling him now. I actually don't know if we opened a lot of Top Scrum last year. I think I ended up selling a bunch because we had the same problem last year as did this year. Years previous, man, I sold Top's Crum like crack. But it was a lot cheaper too. I mean, like I said, it's a, it's definitely overpriced. Some of these teams, I mean, it, it's tough to sell them at that, even at twenty five bucks, because the cards aren't selling high. So I understand. I'm not, I'm not mad at it for not filling. It's just I hate waiting for stuff to fill. Victor Rana for the Phillies, going to Thomas. I hate like for you guys to sit there and buy spots and have to wait three or four days. You know, it's not typical in my room. But when a product sucks, you guys don't buy in. I mean. Other, other rooms are filling them, but for some reason, my room don't touch them. It's been going that with football all year, and so we got a good football product. We weren't filling football at all. I'm like, what the hell is going on? I mean, the products were trash all year until the until Elements. Yeah, they did at zero, but who cares about the Rangers, Sarah? Justin Bourne, number 99. And you still wanted me to sell you the, the Rangers spot. I remember that. They had like two base cards, and you're like, just sell it to me for ten dollars, just so I can get color. I was like, no, I'm not going to give you a shot at a three dollar break credit when there's no autos. <laughs> you fought with me on that. You're trying to buy the Rangers off people for you. You were looking for somebody's color. I don't remember who it was. All right, here we go. Rookie autograph of Walker Bueller. All right, Dodgers, you're done. One to Frank, probably the best Dodgers break Frank's ever had. Hoping for some Matani love there. I think she was bugging me about not selling them as a spot. I think they had one insert auto, 
in all color. And I was like, no, I ain't, I ain't putting them up. I'm not even selling for 10. There's no point of selling it for $10 and shipping it to you. Shipping you two base cards. There's no point. Yeah, you're looking for outdoor colors. Exactly. I remember that. You were bitching that I comboed them. But you always bitch because I combo them all the time. Oh, I know, Ross. But, like, all right. So, for instance, my buddy Pete. I'm not going to. You, you know Pete, Ross. You're in his room. I'm not going to tell you one in his room because I don't want you going there. Um, dude, been on vacation for a week. has come back and, and has filled everything he's posted. I'm like, fuck. I've had the same shit up all week. <laughs> But he's got a lot of guys from eBay breaks. I got. I might just start doing some eBay breaks to get some new, some new faces in the room because he's got a lot of no namers in there. I don't know. I've been in this hobby for a long time. I don't know them people. I mean, I'm not a dick. I don't like add people to my room. I know. Actually, I never add anyone to my room. I let people. If you guys want to add people, feel free to. That's what I always say. I don't. Uh, I don't. I don't go through rooms and add people. I just don't do that. But um. I don't know half them people in his in his break. I used to, so I mean, I've known most of you guys for long, for many years, and I don't care that we share customers. That's fine with me. Like I said, me and him are good friends, so I don't care. But we just have different styles. That's all. But I don't know. Uh, I don't know half the people. I'm just I don't know where he got. I guess he got them all from eBay. Cause I've never I've never even seen him in the Facebook groups. And I've been in these groups for. Eight years now. I used to be more active though. I'm not as active in the groups anymore. Lindor, number to two fifty. Or two ninety nine, sorry. I'm barely active in the groups. Like I don't I don't sell cards in the groups anymore. I don't it's just not worth it. So many people just want to pay nothing for stuff anymore. I'm just gonna yeah, I'll just throw it on eBay. It's not worth wasting my time. Hunter Wood for the raise. Going to Ross. Out of four ninety nine. That's true. That's true, Ross. I mean, he did get his up before mine too. I was a little late on mine. But he's definitely he he does good on them player breaks. I I I haven't tried any of that yet. I really don't want to do eBay breaks. I like to know who's break with me. Like I'm very customer oriented. I don't like strangers spending money with me because I don't know if it's going to get charged back or. So I'm very engaged with you guys. I'm not. I'm not a big fan of. Nice. There you go. There's the Anders R. I know it's not uh nothing huge, but at least it's something cute. It's a start. <laughs> Kyle says you get the same result for the both of us. Your time will come, Kyle. Well, it'll come, dude. Trust me. Listen, Jamie's been with me for Jamie. How long have you been with me for? Two, three years now. And Jamie's had some really good breaks, but she. I mean, listen. That Tani made up for every shitty break I gave her. And I've done that for people. Salvador Perez in the black and white. Mr. Weber. I don't know if Weber's on. Weber's Weber cries all the time. But he'll never mention anyone that I pulled him a card worth $9,000. And then he leaves. It's like, finally, you got me something. Peace out. I made up for all the shitty breaks. And I'll tell you what. The kid, the kid hit all the time. Granny, he bought a lot of teams. But he hit all the time. He just would buy all the big teams and expect to get it big every 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 team. Parker Bridwell, Angels, when a Jason. I love Michael, but the crying, you you can't expect to buy all five big teams in a break and a hit in all five teams. It's not going to happen. You're going to hit one out of them five teams. A good the big player. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing, Ross. That's why I don't want to do any um any player breaks on eBay. I mean, I got a lot of immaculate, man. I got to get rid of it. If it don't start filling, I might do it like a five-case player break on there. And I, I don't want to. I really don't. He said two years and 40 grand. Kyle, he's lying, dude. And the, he better say the big card was with me, Kyle, because I pulled him a Jackie Robinson bat barrel. And he sold it. He got he got nine grand for that. And he got it in cash, face-to-face. -face. He didn't put it on eBay. So... He better be talking about that card. If not, he's a he's a liar. And I've hit him a lot of big cards, dude. Brian Braun, uh, number two one hundred and fifty. I've hit him a lot of big cards. Not I haven't hit him cards worth thousands of thousands, but he's done he's done pretty well on breaks. I mean, the whole thing is is he'll get in a lot of draft breaks and get like 
Ah. Hold on, guys. It's still recording. The stupid OBS. Disconnect it. I'm still here. Are we still here, guys? Facebook disconnected. I'm still live, though. Are we good? All right. Sorry, guys. Facebook disconnected. I, I, I've been live. Or my thing is still recording. Um, Blair, St. Louis. Yeah, you guys will get big cards. Matt, I have pulled you some pretty good cards, man. Oh, you, Kyle. You haven't been in his room for two years, Kyle. You've only been in his room for a year because I just started seeing your name in there all of a sudden. You haven't been there for no two years. I used to break with him all the time for the last year, like just jumping into stuff. I never saw your name. I had um, David. I don't know where David got in trouble and left the country. I've been scared as hell that I get charged back from all his stuff. That dude spent, oh my god, dude. He filled all my breaks. He'd buy cases off me. He did something bad. He left. Kuna, we got a Roddy Reed for Washington going to Matt. Um, I miss him, man. He, he would come in and, oh, there's only 20 teams left. Let's just fill it. I want a break tonight. And he'd buy all the 20 teams. I'm just like, what? Are you dumb, dude? Don't do it. Like I tell him that, like, don't be dumb. You know, as much as I want to break it, I, I felt bad, man. You know, other breakers would be like, yeah, buy them all. I, I, I'm like, dude, don't be dumb. Save your money for this product. Yeah, okay, I don't know the top loaders. All right, I'll the top load. How many I have left here? Three. I'll top load the last two hits my sort. This will go out tomorrow, guys. I have everything else ready to go. I just, I woke up late this morning. Yeah. He got, he disappeared off the face of the earth, Jason. His wife hit me up. Oh, well, the two years went by fast, Kyle. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. He, no, 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 not, not, not that David, Jason. Not that David. No. Um, I don't want to say his name, dude. It's not appropriate. No, ser no, Sirius is cool. He just doesn't really do breaks anymore. He just does mainly hot, really, really high end breaks. Like he'll get in transcendent and all that shit now. You ain't gonna see me breaking that. That's a that's a rip off. Uh no, Kyle, this is the only thing that was close, man. I'll try and run some minis on the Mac but it's already ten o'clock, that's the problem. No one really jumps in minis until until I post them early in the day. That's why I usually don't post any after like eight. Not in my room. Minis are weird, dude. Sometimes a mini will fill in two seconds, and other days they'll take three days. I don't, I don't understand it. No, we can't buy the rest of the spots, man. We'll get Immaculate filled tomorrow, though. I do want to break that. I mean, I want to get through my Immaculate. That's why I'm not posting my Chrome. I want to get through Immaculate. I got to I gotta pay off a lot of stuff next week. All right, Jordan Luplo, Pirates. I'm, I'm glad the really high-end, uh, I can't remember what the heck it's called. We got pushed back to the 28th now. Pittsburgh, going to Bill. Because I, it wasn't a good week for it. Nobody, everyone's broke. What the hell's going on here? Everyone's broke because of Nationals. <laughs> oh, yeah, Sirius is cool, man. I don't, I, I don't talk to him as much anymore. He used to be a big spender in my group. But like I said, he doesn't really do breaks anymore. He just buys cards. He used to do well, but he's lost his ass to be a lot, too. I mean, he could be breaking somewhere else. I don't know. I know he used to break with Cards Infinity big time, and when he came to me. What am I doing? That's not a color. All right, uh, Adrian Sanchez, Washington. Going to Matt. I don't know how people can sit through Cards Infinity. That guy's boring as shit. I can't even watch. Like he, he's, been, he's like the first breaker ever, so he, of course he gets business, and he's been around for a long time. His prices are ridiculous. He's the most boring dude in the world. Nick Williams, number 50 for the Phillies. I, I turn the volume off to watch new releases because I can't sit there and watch. I can't listen to him. I feel bad. I'm sure he's a nice guy, but he just bores the shit out of me. Like, I fall asleep. And it's just, the voice just drives me nuts. I mean, he might say the same thing about me if you ever watched any of my videos. He's probably a nice guy in real life, but I can't I can't do it. <laughs> Frank will tell you. Frank Frank's broke with him. Dominic Smith. Uh, number to 150, Mets. Going to Gregory. I'll have to top load that when I'm done. I ran out of top loaders, but 
Quit being a big spender. You don't. That's not true, Sarah. I talk to all you guys. Sarah, I hear about all your problems. I listen to everything that you're going through in life. I don't want to hear it. You come to me when you have a bad day. Don't sit there and say that I don't. I listen to you all. Trust me. Pusik will even tell you. I, I answer him all the time. And he even he even said that I'm different than most people because I'm here for you guys all. I don't even, don't even give me that crap, Sarah. Shit, most of the real big spenders that spend a ton don't even want to talk to me. They don't even bother me. <laughs> Max Freed. The other David, he never bothered me. He would just be like, hey, man, I'm bored. What kind of cases you got? I want a break. I'm like, all right. <laughs> He never gave. He never told me about his life. Or, you know, I tried to ask him about stuff. He didn't want to talk about it. Now I know why. Something shady was going on, but I didn't have to deal with no drama with him. <laughs> I, I won't. I won't say your stuff out loud. We got a. We got a trout variation. It's the only one I saw in the whole case. There might have been another guys when I start the refractors on top of it. Oh, by the way, Sarah, you had a um, a Texas Rangers auto. Um, of that crappy guy that I pulled you tonight, stuck to another card when I when I sorted the second case. He did hit an auto in that. James Italian, black and white. It was it was like literally glued to the back of the card. All right, Ryan McMahon for the Rockies. Uh, Combos? No. Yeah, combo spot. Going to Jason. Sorry, I didn't get you any. Where's his face, Jason? I always I always answer. Man, I get I get questions. You guys don't even know. I'm trying to sort a case of this, and I'll have every two minutes a question about value, a question about anything, personal life. I don't mind. Don't get me wrong, but I don't want anyone to ever say I don't answer you because that's that's a load of crap right there. All right, guys, let's do a quick recap. Pretty pretty. I mean, we got some good hits in the case. It wasn't a bad one. Just we didn't get the really big ones, big guys. All right, we got uh, Ryan McMahon for the Rockies, Trout Variation, Max Free for the Braves, Dominic Smith, number to 150. We had Nick Williams for the Phillies, the 50. Adrian Sanchez for Washington, Jordan Luffalo for the Pirates, Roddy Reed for Washington, uh, Valera for St. Louis, Ryan Braun to 150. Parker Bridwell for the Angels. We had Miguel Anujar for the Yankees. Hunter Wood out of 49 for the Rays, Lindor number to 250. Walker Bueller, Dodgers. We had a uh, Justin Bourne on 99, Victor Rano for the Phillies, A.J. Minter to 50 for the Braves, Scott Kingery for the Phillies. We had a, uh, it's 99, we had a uh, Troy Schreibner, Schribner, whatever his name is for the Angels, Richard Arena for the Blue Jays, Sandy Alcantara for Miami, Kyle Farmer for the Dodgers, John Lester number to 150 for Chicago. We had Jose Altuve to 99 for the Astros, Jackson Stevens number to 150 for the Reds, uh, James Italian out of 99 for the Pirates, Vieira for the White Sox. We had a uh, Rays Maranta for San Fran, Greg McMahon number to 299 for the Rockies. Schreibner again, number to 150 for the Angels. Mella for the Reds. We had a Raphael Devers on the rookie debut med medallion card for Boston. Uh, Harrison Bader for the Cardinals. We had Chris Davis, number to 150 for the Athletics. Brian Anderson for Miami. We had Alex Verdugo, number to 499 for the Dodgers. Clint Frazier, 99 for the Yankees. This is who you had, Sarah. He was stuck to another card. Uh, backwards of all things, too. Uh, Ronald Herrera for Texas. We had Tanner Scott for the Orioles. Nice Verdugo, number to 250 for the Dodgers. Felix Herhey for the Twins, Andrew Miller for the Indians, number to 50, Walker Bueller, number to uh, 299 for the Dodgers, Ryder Jones for San Fran, we had a uh, Tyron Guerrero, I don't know if he's any good, number to 250 for the Marlins, Marlins stink, Chance Sisko for the Orioles, Jacob Barnes for the Brewers, we had AJ Minter for the Braves, Tim Beckham for the Orioles at 99, Lucas Sims for the Braves, J.D. Davis for Houston, Neymar Mazar at a 150, uh, Dylan Peters for Miami, Zach Grant for the Twins, Clint Frazier number two, 250, or 299 for the Yankees, Andrew Stevenson for Washington, and Thomas Nito for the Mets. Yeah, I even I can't throw a free box in Kyle. Yeah, I, I wished. If I could have charged the full amount for this break, then I could have thrown a free box in. No. <laughs> How do you discount it, man? I, I discount it the cost of a box, so I can't do that. I can't, I can't be breaking even on shit, man. Not especially when shit's slow. You're killing me. Hey, look, if I was like platinum breaks, guys, which if you guys break with them, you're crazy. But whatever, you go ahead. I would throw all kinds of free shit in because they're charging. 
out to ask. You guys don't see their full prices until they because they, they do it online. Like you can't even see their you don't even get their price out their stuff. You'd be amazed at what they're making on their cases, guys. That's why they can do free shit. Plus, they fill stuff all day long. I mean, the people go to them like crack, but they're they're terrible at customer service. One. Second, they're ghetto as fuck. They're good people. I, I actually was friends with them for a while. They're good people. They helped me out with some things, but good luck. Good luck ever getting an answer from them if something gets screwed up. They've lost some big customers that I know very well because of the, the customer service. So that's what I pride myself on. But listen, if I could fill stuff like them or or, or price my stuff where I'm making, you know, 500 to 1,000 a case, oh, guys, I'd be throwing all kinds of free shit in. But I, I don't do that. So I unfortunately, I can't. Um, I will work on the $200 credits this month for the minis. I'm sorry I've been behind on that. It is a lengthy process if I don't keep up with it, and I haven't been. So I have to go back to June and July and, and do all the lists, and it's going to take a little bit of time. Uh, tomorrow, I'm probably I probably have plenty of time to do it. So I will um, I'll I'll do it to, I'll get it done tomorrow. That I can promise. So I'll get that done at least. Um, I mean, there's like the only giveaways I can really do that and thirty dollars per break. I mean, it adds up. That's really all I can I can do for freebies, guys. But once in a blue moon, I will do I will do some crazy shit for free. It's just I got to have a good month. If I don't have a good month, I you know, I can only give so much out. If I take away the three thirty dollar credit every break, I could do like one big giveaway a month, but only one person's gonna win it. I think the thirty dollar credit every break helps fill the break, so that's why I like doing that. Plus, it gives you a shot at getting something back every break, not just one giveaway. You know, so. All right, guys. Talk to you soon. Appreciate you all as always. And um, I'll try and get clearly authentic posted tomorrow. I don't know if the checklist is out yet. And Donruss football, I'm still waiting on the checklist. So um, for now, we're just got immaculate up. We got that awesome super break up too. Everyone gets a one on one. Uh, the memorabilia is cool. You get like pieces of cleats and not like a little chunk. You get like a piece of it. It's a pretty uh, pretty cool product. You get cut autos. Some are some are graded. Um, it's a five by seven, so it's not small. Um, there is redemptions to get real big pieces of stuff too. It's generally hard to hit, but we can get like a Babe Ruth autograph ball or a Babe Ruth autograph. You usually have the redemptions through Super Break, but we can pull Jordan. There's all kinds of stuff we can pull in there. It's all different stuff. You're welcome, Jamie. But I uh, hope we can get that going. We got uh, 13 left in there, 14 left in that. Um, I've never broke it before. It's the first year they did an all all bar product, so I broke other super break. It's hit pretty good. There's some big monsters in it. So all right guys, I'll get this all out for you tomorrow. All your mail will be out tomorrow. That's a hundred percent guaranteed. It's all sorted, ready to go. All right, I appreciate you guys.